Hi guys, I'm back for another Help Me Remember. Alright, we're going to see what's going on here. I'm just going to pull some cards. Maybe it'll spark a memory. Maybe there's something that you guys forgot about. Maybe a detail that you need. There's something here with somebody who gambled at a casino. So we have a gambler at a casino. Something about tickets or scratch-off. So it could be a casino. It could be tickets or scratch-off. There's something here uh, with an island. Somebody could have went away to an island resort somewhere. You could have traveled. So this casino could have been on an island resort. A private resort. Where you had some sort of a romance. Yep, you could be a public figure, it says also. Some of you guys had to pull over and throw up somewhere. Some Somebody fell asleep at the wheel driving. An older brother. Oh, and you have some of you guys have an older brother that slept with your friend. Like maybe you had a Twinkie that slept with our niece. I don't know. Something like that. You know that girl don't like you. Like, you a dumb. Like, why would you do that? I don't know if he was trying to get back for your wife having a Chinese or Asian baby. Like, I don't know what that was. I think it was some kind of payback for what she did. But you felt, I don't know what you were thinking. Something with music. Something about a DJ at a concert. Something about telemetry. Gas, electric, telemetry. That keeps coming up. Somebody tricks somebody into something. Something about delivery, supply. Somebody... Somebody sent somebody to get your business model. The way you guys do something in a company. Some of you guys could work for Sprint. There's something here with an Asian woman that comes up. There's something here also with an Asian man that might be codependent for whatever. Maybe they're codependent on each other. You could be Asian and maybe you're codependent on each other. Something about a cell phone tower. All right. A cell phone tower, but also GPS. Somebody could be tracking you. There's something with banking accounts being hacked by another country. For some of you guys, your accounts being hacked by another country. The order could have been sent out by a former president, maybe Trump, you know, as an example. All right. There's something with T-Mobile. They could have stolen your information or somebody hacked it and allowed them to micromanage, not micromanage, monitor you. What do they call it? Some sort of monitoring, remote monitoring. Okay, so we have that. Something could have happened at Yale, could be Yale Hospital, Yale University. These all could be connected because I also have Ivy League again. There's something here about Harvard that comes up. Something could have happened in Mexico. So somebody from Yale and Harvard could have been in Mexico at a resort, pulled over to throw up or something like that, whatever that's about. Take what resonates. Somebody embezzled some money. There's also something here about Verizon. So you guys could have Verizon cell phones. That's one of Trump's people that just passed by. They got that flag and the thing and all that stuff. They passing by fast because their balls ain't big enough to stop. They already know what it is if they do. Somebody works at Verizon. Somebody does something with stocks. Some D. Cameron is a coon and a piece of shit. Mm -hmm. I said it, nigga. I said it online too. You a clan member. Somebody's filing for bankruptcy. Stocks and bonds. There's something here about a white man. There could be a white man, a fish shortage. So maybe there's a white man. I don't know if they work, if he works in, you know how the water with a fisherman? He could be a fisherman. Somebody could be a, I don't know, it just says white man. He could be American or whatever, right? It could also be Russian, could be from any country. Take it how it resonates, right? There's something coming up with a beef shortage. Yeah. I'm gonna put these away. Put them to the side as I get to them. I like them because they're kind of random. They're all over the place. It sparks a lot of thought, right? There's also something about somebody going undercover, right? So that could be a cop who's undercover or... <laughs> listen, undercover, right? And then it says down low. Somebody could be on the down low too. Somebody could be sleeping with the same sex. Most likely probably a man. Uh, somebody has some other options here. Somebody has some options. It looks like there's a ton of options that somebody's got. Yes, I do. <laughs> It was a quick thing. Somebody has like five people that they're dealing with, right? Five different people. So you're usually dealing with a hoe. <laughs> somebody's doing work only. Somebody's messing with somebody work only so there's no confusion. I will only do work with you so there's no confusion. So somebody is not going to get involved with you guys romantically. Somebody's not going to get involved with you guys romantically because they want to just keep it work, all right? Or let me see what the other piece says. Oh, it says work only. Love only is at the bottom. What's upright is work only. So whoever you are, this person's only going to work with you. They're not going to have anything else with you. Something having to do with karma. Yeah, hold on. Something having to do with karma. We have Tasha K that comes up. 
It says here, Janetta is not ashamed. She's just ashamed that she got caught. So if you guys have a Janetta in your life, Janetta is going to be like a Ghislaine Maxwell. She's somebody that sets up ex-trafficking for old, dirty, nasty mega preachers and old, nasty men. And she'll go to different countries to do it. So you guys might have somebody like a Janetta who's actually a Ghislaine Maxwell. Okay? They play the same role. Somebody's a gold digger. Hold on. Right, somebody setting up sex for old men with younger kids identity fraud again it keeps coming up somebody bought houses under your name guys this is also something about the civil police something about the civil police um, let me leave that there because i don't think that's mine <laughs> no i don't play you know i call up the civil. anyway somebody has a lot of work to do or something like that somebody's focused on work this could be the person who is just going to be working with you. They're not going to have anything romantic with you. There's a false lady out there. It says that this person is calling. There's a false lady calling your job. There's something where somebody put holes in your lawnmower. There's lies, slander. So there's a false lady telling lies about you and doing things to your property. Your property. There's something with conspiracy. And this person also put you in a romance scam. This person has been reported to the FBI or you need to report them to the FBI for false reports. And there's also extortion here. So somebody's being extorted. All right. Extorted, exploited. I believe somebody did something. They don't want it to come out. So they had no choice but to hand over control to, I guess, the evil powers that be. So they could, I don't know. Basically, somebody's going to hang you out to dry so they don't get caught. Right? They don't want their crap to come out. So they'd rather throw you under the bus. Right? Like that. Like they're still not going to get caught. I don't know what's wrong with these folks. Give me more. What else we got going on over here? That's six minutes. Hold on. Right, what else we got <sighs> somebody's name could start with a T U or B this could be your work boo I have no door one. somebody's obsessed in stalking you somebody is by a bonfire so somebody's obsessed with you they could be if you guys went to a bonfire and somebody's staring at you that could be it that's a long shot but something about obsession something about a bonfire somebody's networking or networker there's a judge who's in love with a cop a judge is in love with a cop. Ooh. Your ex slept with your bestie last night. These people are crazy. Hold on. Um, your ex slashed your tires. Somebody stole your money. Somebody who's a sex worker. They probably waited for you to be knocked out. Then they took the money out your pocket. Somebody wants you to tell your story. You should probably tell it, all right? If you guys feel like you are trapped and you need to be liberated, tell your story. And it also says not only tell your story, tell the whole story, right? So you can help other people. Somebody wants to know if you're interested in them. Something about North America, Egypt, Libya, North, North Africa, Egypt, Libya, Sudan, Tunisia, Tunisia um, Tanzania, Monaco, whatever. I don't know if you guys come from there or... There's something about a maid at a hotel that found something. Maybe you were in North Africa when they found this item or something like that. There's some sort of witness out there. They found the witness that they were looking for. Somebody says, my attorney will get me off. So this person is very confident. Big surprise, my attorney is going to get me off. Some of you guys need to check your status. Some of you guys in the system. Okay, so if you go into the DMV system, some of you guys were labeled um, organ donors and you're not. And you know when you're not an organ donor, in some cases, they're not going to try and save you. So you want to go back and check your paperwork and make sure it says you are not an organ donor. Okay, so you may not be an organ donor. I would check and see, like I'm saying publicly, I am not an organ donor. So if it says that I am, I am not an organ donor, right? All right, so for some of you guys, all of you, never look back. Don't go back. That's like Lot's wife, right? Your blessings are coming. Can a hell tell turn into a fairy tale? <laughs> Keep the faith. What else here? Somebody's dating you for the money. Somebody's dating. Somebody dated your enemy or is dating your enemy and they didn't tell you about it. <clears throat> this is a third party. There's a lover involved. The third party lover is involved in this situation who could be a frat boy, coven boy, or from a group of boys or something like that. There's also something where somebody's catfishing you. Let me just straighten these up real quick. Hold on. Somebody could be catfishing you guys. All right, got 
those. Somebody remembers their first kiss. Whatever that's about. Something about an ambulance. Take what resonates. I watch your family, but I'm uncertain of my feelings for you. Whatever that's about. Somebody's name could start with a K. Somebody's name could be K, like a K right. All right. I can feel you in my heart when I'm down. So somebody might be feeling you or you, they feel your presence when they're down. Somebody cannot return to the United States because of something that they did. We were drinking and it just happened. Somebody got pregnant after a night of drinking. I think this is an extension, it feels like, of the last read, but this is a separate read. It does mention some sort of resort here. So somebody was drinking on a resort, woke up naked. Somebody has a broken heart. They're broken hearted because there's no more us, they say. So you guys could have been a really big, maybe a happy couple and no more stings. Somebody got, oh, so somebody got stung or this is about a sting. It could be an operation or a sting. It could be... It could be an FBI sting. It could be a police, whatever kind of sting. You know what I mean, right? All right. What else is here? Let me do a few more and I'm out. Let me pull up. Let me... Somebody says they know that you're not their type, but they'll try anyway. Somebody could listen to Danny Tanagli at a DJ. Somebody says, I understand why you don't trust me. There's also, oh, jeez. I ain't going, hold on. There's also, hold on, listen to this. There's also a rich black man is in love with you. You guys could have some rich black guy in love with you. Let's see, what else do we have? Somebody is, somebody's lazy, first of all. Somebody from the law could be lazy. You guys could have somebody who's in law enforcement who's lazy. Whatever that's about. Somebody's on strike, meaning they could be on strike from the job, or they could be on strike from you, or they could be on strike from having sex with you. <laughs> Somebody says, we will dismantle your company. That feels very, uh, that feels like you guys have a competitor or you have a company that is doing something illegal and they're not having it anymore. Something in Alaska. So we have Alaska, somebody's son. Somebody has a son. This is somebody's sibling, obviously. But it's funny, it comes out son, sibling. So that's confirmation. Somebody's son, somebody manipulated an earnings report. Whatever that's about. So somebody's son manipulated an earnings report. That sucks because now whoever's in charge of the company got to come back and answer for it. So if you own a company and your son alters some documents, unfortunately for you, you're going to have to answer to that, right? Because you let him do it. Somebody didn't tell you the details of the job that they asked you to do. So the job or the task that they asked you to do, somebody didn't give the details. Somebody's name could be Brown or Brown, last name Brown, color Brown. Somebody wants you to know that yes, they know what you're hiding. Somebody's well aware that you guys are hiding something. Whoever you are, they know. White woman. There could be a white woman from New Jersey who knows something. <gasps> North Carolina A and T. Maybe somebody went there. X. That could be Twitter or somebody's last name could be X. Letter X could be significant. There's a businesswoman out here who's a CEO, day trader, and she's also a teacher. Ooh, that's a, that's as far a stretch, but I guess it's possible. Somebody wants to be a playboy. Somebody's going to a new state or moving to a new state. Somebody, ooh, there's a Sagittarius that could be moving to a new state. Hold on. Sagittarius moving to a new state. What else here? Somebody admires you, but they're scared. Hmm. They're just, ah, I think they're scared to tell you something. There's something here about trafficking, whatever that means, whatever kind of trafficking. That could be drug trafficking, people. Somebody says a secret pregnancy that shows up here. Uh, your child or children are in denial about a secret pregnancy. No expectations. Somebody's saying, I don't know you. So you guys could be pregnant by somebody and then they turn around and say they don't know who you are. Good child. Something about Atlanta children. You remember the, uh, the missing children from Atlanta back in the day? That's what this is here. The Atlanta child herders, like that. So we have that coming up, right? 
somebody's waiting to be sentenced for something that they did. I don't know if that has to do with the Atlanta children from back in the day. Uh, are those people? I think those folks are still alive. Somebody's getting caught up for the Atlanta child issues back in the day. I, I, that was back when I was little. That was a really big thing. All these kids went missing from Atlanta. They said they found, I think they said they found, they stopped or something like that. But somebody's going down for that because apparently they didn't get everybody. So these people are going back and you have had people getting caught up for crimes from way back when. Somebody's keeping tabs and notes on you. They're tracking the details. Somebody was disconnected or cut off from their insurance company for whatever reason, right? Somebody's name could start with a C. Also, somebody was disconnected or cut off from an insurance, right? So somebody took you off the insurance or maybe they cut off your insurance like Denise Wilkins did to my insurance, right? Mm -hmm. Anyway, what else here? There's a cult-like group. I don't know what that's about. Something about a cult and a group. Your attorney is a snake who wants revenge. Mm. There's something with a millionaire. There's an attorney who wants revenge on a snake who's a millionaire. There's a bank crash coming. Hang on. I don't know if that's one bank or two banks either of them. I don't know if that's one bank or two banks. It sounds like it's a bank, but... I would say prepare if, you, if it's a a bank crash and we all have different banks. I think many banks are gonna crash. That's the way it feels. Hang on. Somebody has somebody is all right. This is what some of you guys might be going through. All right, there's some negotiation going on with foreign countries to get your money. Right, so some of you guys have money that people put in different accounts in different places. It looks like there's some negotiations going on to get the money from the accounts and get it back over to you. That's what it looks like. There's something here where somebody's voting or something going on with voting. Voting came out reverse here. Somebody doesn't want you to vote. There's something with the food industry. There's a food industry. There's also, like I said, there's also something about beef. Somebody got cornered by their local AG. I don't know what that means, so that might mean if you're cornered by your AG, that means the AG probably got something on you. So if you're a criminal, I would be really careful, especially if you're a criminal who's got a new kid coming. doesn't feel like you're going to be around long to hang out with the kid if the AG is up your ass, okay? So we have jam band. Some of you guys could be listening to a jam band. People are laughing and gossiping about you. There's also more pregnancy here. Something about pregnancy builds money. An illusion. Somebody tried to paint an illusion around a pregnancy. Somebody's name could start with a Z. Somebody's name could also start with an N, whatever that's about. You might have somebody named Novia who's pregnant, or somebody sent you baby clothes. It could be a Tanisha. It could be a Novia who's pregnant. Who knows if you guys know a Novia? She could be Jamaican. DCF is, DCF is looking for you. Hold on, let me plug this up. Hold on, y'all. Let me see if this sucker all right, there we go. All right, one more. Initiation. Somebody did something out of initiation at the DCF. IRS is involved now. This could be a Leo and a Gemini responsible for something with the IRS. A Leo and Gemini. This could be a couple. They could be friends, whatever. Somebody put the group in the spotlight. They didn't want the spotlight on them. Too bad, honey. It's already on you. Matter of fact, we're going to make sure to shine all in your face. The Coven is under investigation. Look at that. Aquarius and Leo could be part of a Coven that's under investigation. Somebody says, I sent him to you. So you have a Coven of people that sent somebody to you. I sent her to you. So we have an I sent him to you or her to you. Covers male and female. Somebody's gambling. It's more gambling going on here. Somebody sold stocks before the crash. Does that sound legal to you? Because it sounds like it's insider training. Or somebody literally could have sold before the crash. Maybe somebody saw it coming. And somebody was trying to make it look like you guys were unstable like oh you can't read or like um like they made a report that I was incapacitated can't walk me while honey please I mean do I sound like really right so you know you have the like my story the genetics of the world went and signed something and said I was incapacitated or not alive even though I'm at work every day but remember this same person Janetta Beasley Janetta Copeland Beasley hold on plays the role of Jazane, what's her name, Jazane Maxwell, that's who she is, she probably did something like this, right, sign some sort of report to make it look like you weren't alive or something like that, even though you're on the radio every day, 
<laughs> we have a lobbyist here. All right, this person could have been a lobbyist who wanted things to go their way. There's a preacher out there who's going to get caught for drunk driving. How embarrassing for you. That's why I'd rather not have that title. I'd rather have the title of YouTuber got arrested versus preacher got arrested for drunk driving or whatever. But anyway, something with freight. Something's going on with freight. It could be a train. Somebody slandered you. Freight. Mm. Something could be on. Something could be on a freight. Somebody loses their wealth. Anything else here? Let me look to cut this off. Hold on, I got something about Dubai City. Somebody could be in Dubai, was in Dubai. Somebody could have been in Haiti. This could be an international group because remember, there are international accounts here where somebody was trying to hide your money or something like that, right? Somebody could have been trying to hide Bitcoin. Some political leader made a deal with a church leader. Mm. Let's see. Those could be two Geminis who did that. You could have fuck nigga Trump. And then you could have fuck nigga Jakes that made a good agreement. I don't know. Just an example. Anything else? I think I'm going to leave it there. That's funny enough. I love you guys. Bye.